Hey, it's Loaf. Most of you that watch the channel aren't subscribed, so if you like our content and want to see more, simply tossing us a like and slapping that subscribe button really helps this channel grow. And with that, let's get on to today's story which comes from Mr. Beast. Now we've talked about Mr. Beast before, he runs a YouTube channel and gives away a ton of money, while simultaneously making sure it's for a good cause. In one of our recent videos, we talk about a Russian YouTuber by the name of A4. Mr. Beast being as successful as he is, has been the target of much content plagiarism. Whether it be blatantly ripping video thumbnails and ideas for views, or just simply doing similar challenge videos, there's no doubt that a lot of content creators look up to him. Although, some impersonators have been taking it a little bit too far. On April of last year, Mr. Beast tweeted out a warning to his fans. Almost every other tweet I've gotten recently is about this fake ad. I let YouTube know. If it doesn't come from a verified Mr. Beast, it's not me. At first, it's a seemingly normal Mr. Beast thing to do, right? Except for the fact that the advertiser has no profile picture and it's from a guy named G. Mayer. Fast forward a few months and now there are the exact same ads offering the same PlayStation gift card, but this time from a user with the name Beast Cards, which coincidentally has no content or verification. If you see this ad, it's not me. I've been getting tons of tweets about it and it's a scam. I will only mention giveaways on my verified accounts. If it's not verified, it's not me. The scammers are not only paying to have their ads played on YouTube, but they also began to flood the comment section of every video they could. A cryptic message offering something special, with a link leading you to a site that asks you for your credit card number and those wacky digits on the back. You may notice that these comments have a way of dodging the spam filters by constantly changing the emojis and numbers used between each one. One thing to note is the absurd amount of likes that each one gets despite being posted for only one minute. Upon visiting their profile, you'll see a YouTube playlist that has been renamed to Uploads, which at first glance looks very convincing. However, if you click on the videos, it's very obvious that the channel is fake. Now, if that wasn't enough, they also have begun sliding in random DMs. If you have ever left a comment on a Mr. Beast video in the past, you may have encountered this. Awesome vid, more content please. Also, can we be YouTube friends? I got that exact same comment on my YouTube video. I got that exact same message just on a different account. It's obviously the same person managing multiple channels. What the frick? I just peed myself. Hello, thank you for commenting on my videos. I am selecting random user from my subscriber list for a gift and you have just won it. Click here to redeem it. Mr. Beast, is this a scam? It's not working. It would be nice if it stopped there, but the scammers are making an appearance in the live streaming community and hosting fake giveaways. If it wasn't their own live stream, it was also happening in the live chat rooms of other verified streamers. One page was seen doing a very innocent fundraiser for an orphan kid's charity, with the catch that if you donated $50, you would get a free Samsung Galaxy Note 9 and an exclusive Mr. Beast hoodie if you visited a website called fundraiser.com. Okay. It got so out of hand that some impersonators didn't even care for the money anymore and decided to join in simply for the entertainment. For young Twitch streamer Jaden, he was convinced by a fake Mr. Beast to pour water all over his gaming console in exchange for a large donation. You want to do a challenge for a or a video? Yeah, sure. What is it? I feel like the fans right here. Did it. It's coming out from right here where the power button is. Moments later, his console began spewing toxic fumes as he covered his fan and ran out of the room. To be fair, the impersonator's name in this case was not Mr. Beast 6000. Another poor soul was convinced to throw his entire PC into the bathtub for a similar $5,000 donation from Mr. Beast. Do you want to say any last words before you throw it? Um, let's just say, I hope this is real. Now, Mr. Beast has actually talked to YouTube in the past to try and bring light to the issue. Literally everyone who comments on my videos gets messaged by multiple Mr. Beasts. It is literally pissing me off that kids are getting non-stop scammed by fake me and YouTube is doing nothing. To which YouTube responded with, Thanks for bringing this to our notice. Have you tried reporting this user for impersonation since he is pretending to be you? Read through this article for your options and more info. Hope this helps. 
Others have been dealing with the problem for a long time, and have yet for them to be resolved. Good luck getting them to do anything about it. For the last two months, I've had my videos used for fake ads, and 12 copyright strikes later, YouTube still doesn't stop them. Imagine thinking those are real. <laughs> wow, being famous comes with a toll. If you are YouTube famous, you get your face slapped into every nook and cranny. Hate seeing these types of ads, and YouTube doesn't even check that these ads are put out there. People will get viruses or scammed if this isn't fixed. Wait, that was fake? No wonder mommy got mad. Now, usually we loaf to serve you a hot slice of news in the most unbiased manner as possible. But for something like this, I feel like it's probably a good idea to say something as cliche as, if it's too good to be true, it's probably fake. And don't put any electronics into water. The best way to check is to confirm that the account has a verified symbol. After all, you wouldn't want to miss an actual giveaway from the real Mr. Beast. Anyway, that's all for today. Until next time, keep it fresh. See ya.